This latest shooting happened tonight near 30th and Keystone just after 8 p.m. We know a man was shot and killed there at the scene. We just got an update from police on this shooting just within the last 30 minutes. We're going to take you right now live there where Justin Collar is on the near northeast side. And Justin, what are police telling you? I know this is still developing as we speak. Yeah, good evening, team. We're working hard to find those answers for you tonight, but not as hard, I feel, as the brave law enforcement officers with IMPD here who have now responded to 207 deadly homicides here tonight with the latest unfolding just behind us in the near northeast side of the city near the intersection of 30th and Carolyn Avenue. We know that this happened near uh, the outside of the church behind me and the convenience store there just out in that area here. We know that that, uh, that man was shot here. They were able to transport him to a nearby hospital where he was later pronounced dead. We spoke with police tonight on their emotions and their message to the city after what has not only been a deadly year, but a deadly 24 hours in the city. It's frustrating. You've heard me say it throughout the year. Um, folks have got to understand how to resolve conflict resolution without picking up a firearm or some instrument and hurting someone. Now we are still working to learn more information from the scene here tonight, but you can see a, a bevy of, of uh, markings out here in the street here along 30th. We know that the man who was shot was shot multiple times and they found shell casings, so many in fact, that they're not sure they came from one gun. One gun, excuse me. As we uh, remain at the scene, we are still working to learn more information and we'll provide you with updates throughout the evening. We're reporting live in the city's near northeast side. I'm Justin Kolar, Fox 59 News. Justin, thank you. The numbers continue to be staggering. This is now the 207th homicide investigation in our city this year. Right now, IMPD is also on the scene of another shooting, a separate shooting. IMPD confirming to Fox 59 a person was shot here near 42nd and Arlington this evening. That person, we can tell you, is in critical condition, so we are praying that person does pull through. In the meantime, we are working to get more information. This violence tonight coming off what was a deadly night last night here in Indianapolis. Yeah, four people were killed last night in our city, and that with just within two hours.